All right, still on TVC Breakfast Saturday, we went to the streets yet again to ask Nigerians this question, what does the mantra, no grief for anyone, mean to you? For me, it's relative. Um, when I mean relative, it could connote different things. So, no grief for bad governance, no grief for mediocrity, no grief for um, corruption or, or embezzlement, anything that has to do with being in conformity with um, the social ease of vice, don't agree to it. It may mean a lot to so many other people, but for me what it means is just fun. I mean, Nigeria has come to the stage that um, you need to be happy otherwise you die. If you take everything serious, you will die off. What you want to focus on, go straight for it. No grief for anybody to kill your dream. Simple. Somebody might try to intimidate you because the Lord has agreed for him in this year. And he might feel like, okay, uh, God has agreed for me. God, has, God is hearing my prayer and God is answering my prayer. So for that, he wanted to use it to intimidate others. And uh, if others now agreed, so that intimidation, it means setback is coming. So don't grieve for anybody. You shouldn't give up. You shouldn't accept everything they bring to you. The slang, no grief for anybody, literally means uh, be resilient. Be Don't think about other people's opinion, right? Just focus on what you want and get it with, at any cost. Me, it actually means that, like, don't give up, you know. Uh, maybe you are trying to get something and maybe you are trying to, like, you know, at any high level in something, somehow you meet obstacles, but see, you still have to fight. If you see someone that is beyond anything or someone that is beyond your own power, beyond your capacity, and this like is telling you that don't grieve for anybody, you are the one that will suffer at last. So you have to look at the situation. Is it what I can take control? Is it what is beyond my control? Then you may not grieve for that. But when it's above your capacity, then you better grieve for it and let it go. But the positive part is this, that, okay, maybe there's something you have been clamoring to overcome and there's a challenge facing it then you can continue you may not grieve for that situation to suppress you fight for what you can get you know claim it by force or with any form of aggression or anything we're in nigeria so we have um, tough skin so just fight for what you can get it means that stand up for your rights so as uh, you know there's a common saying that amumu is over so let's do the right things it's not about doing it negatively no it's all about doing the right thing, that's all. Don't give for, do the right thing, let the right thing be done. You have heard what residents in Lagos have to say about this new mantra, no grief for anybody. For some people it is positive, while others think it is negative. But to you, what do you think about this? Right. Initially, it was no grief for anyone, meaning be determined this new year. Then the army also latched on. Mm -hmm. Governor Sonwulu also latched that on means. that man mantra. But mm -hmm. the police is now saying, saying it could mean something you can't uh, be drastically. crime, and you're saying no grief for anybody. They're that, even that's... saying that they have information mm -hmm. that people are going to use that slang to perpetrate chaos, chaos. which they will, of course, uh, not stand for. But for me, I would say. I no go grief for anybody. So for you, you are running with that. You are running with. You are running with no grief for anyone mantra. Taking away from not fulfilling your destiny. Distracting you. Distraction. Mm. No grief for disappointment. Okay. 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 And also ensure that you fulfill your destiny. <laughs> <laughs> uh, all right, all right. That said, but just um, let's just toe mm. the line of law and order this year, That's as it. you do not grieve for anyone, so to speak. It's time for entertainment now. Theophilus and Adibanke are right here to take us through the fascinating world of entertainment. Stay with us.